Welcome to the Palace of Westminster. Um, this is where it all happens, the seat of British power on a day which has descended into total and utter chaos. The flag is still flying, um, Big Ben is still chiming, but beneath that all there is a media circus with the resignation of David Cameron and everyone scrabbling for power at the Labour Party. So you can see here the scene that you see on TV in the background. This is where all the filming happens and all the interviewing of politicians and pundits. And uh, it's quite fun to watch. Um, it wasn't as chaotic, maybe, as I make out. But uh, what I really wanted to show you today is a little piece of gold that arrived in the office. This is a little package that arrived from Germany. And this was a coin that uh, I won at an eBay auction. Um, while I'm opening this, can we can't really believe, I can't believe that gold, I think today it hit £1,005 uh, an ounce, which is, you know, a, comparatively in pounds, because I know a lot of you don't think in pounds, it was £720 an ounce in December, and it's £1,005 an ounce today. So in sterling terms, absolutely massive um, increase in value of, uh, of gold. Anyway, this little piece here is a panda and it's, a, uh, uh, it's not in the original packaging, but in the picture on eBay, it looked in pretty good condition. So I'm hoping it's gonna be a good one that is suitable for, uh, for my usual slabbing. So let's have a look at it close up. It's a 2006 and it's a 120th of an ounce uh, panda. If you take a look at the uh, mintages, uh, the 20th of an ounce for 2006 is actually one of the lowest mintages 20ths there's been. You can see in 2007, the mintage went up to 200,000 and in 2008, the mintage went up to um, 200,000 as well. So 2006, very good pickup, very good year to get a 20th of an ounce. Um, it actually looks like it's been pretty well cared for in a nice airtight. Um, it looks to me perfect. Um, I can't see any sign of any damage on it. Um, it's possible this will get a 70. I don't know. If it does, I'll be thrilled. But we'll see. Um, it's always a little bit potluck whether they'll find something under the magnifying glass. But... Um, the earlier 20ths had a, uh, a nominal value of 5 yuan, and this one has a value of 20 yuan. Uh, and it's interesting that um, the, the new 1 gram has a value of 10 yuan. So you get all, all these kind of different things. Uh, it can be a little bit confusing sometimes when you see, for example, uh, a new quarter ounce one has a value of 100 yuan, whereas the old 1 ounce had a value of 100 and now the new one ounce, or the new 30 gram, has got a value of um, 500 yuan. Anyway, enough about the renminbi, uh, the yuan currency. Let me know what you think of this beautiful little 2006 panda, and of course the nasty, nasty Brexit situation over in my united, not-for-long kingdom. Mm -hmm.